So yesterday we discussed two patients with issues in their hands, but which one should we see first? The more urgent case is the hiker. They have an expanding pink rash with a pale centre, recently travelled to Vermont, and now has radicular arm pain with extensive weakness in their hand. This all suggests she could have Lyme disease with nerve involvement, more specifically causing a radicular neuritis. So what should we do? We should send Lyme disease serology, but we shouldn't wait for the result to treat. Start immediate IV antibiotics for at least 14 days. We need to arrange neurology and infectious disease follow-up with a daily examination of her hand to check for progression. A bullseye rash and hiking in New England. This rash is erythema migrans, typical of Lyme disease in almost all cases. Then we have the radicular pain and focal limb weakness. This is classic stage 2 neuro Lyme disease. Maybe antibiotics help prevent permanent motor deficit. Oral doxycycline is not enough once motor symptoms appear. Patient 2, on the other hand, shows pretty textbook carpal tunnel syndrome. Nocturnal median nerve tingling resolved by shaking the hand. Night splints and activity moderation initially are all that are really needed. So what should we cover next? Leave your suggestions in the comments and follow for next week's case.